What's up, everybody? Tim Anderson here, a.k.a. Renfell, playing Parsect, the Republic trooper here in my ongoing Star Wars The Old Republic playthrough. This is one of the few storylines I've actually not gone through the origin story of through to level 50. I've got my uh, BD droid, I mean, sorry, RE1 scout droid here with me. We might call him BD from time to time just because we're confused. <laughs> anyway, if you like this series and you haven't already done so, like, subscribe, hit the bell icon to get more like this, and continue as I journey along with this character in the play series here on YouTube. Support the channel in any way you can, because it keeps me going full-time. If you do appreciate the content that I produce, just consider it like another Netflix or something else. You know, just do what you can, cup of coffee, lots of different ways to support. They're all up on the screen above you. In the meantime, let's continue where we left off last time. Um, Havoc Squad is working to locate a ZR-57 orbital strike bomb stolen by Separatist forces on the war-torn world of Ord Mantell. A refugee named Miru claims to have information on the Separatists' plan for the bomb, so Fuse and Lieutenant Jorgen have ordered me to investigate. So my objective right now is to meet Miru in the refugee camp outside the northern entrance to Fort Garnick. So that's what we're going to go off and do. But before we do, we actually need to make a pit stop. Because I haven't actually trained yet. Somewhere over here is my trainer, I think. Well, Actually, I don't... Ah, here it is. There it is. Over there to the left. Or do you not have to train anymore? Because it's not showing up. Maybe your abilities are automatic these days? Oh. Guess there's nothing there for me to train. Alright. Here's the person we're supposed to be meeting. I like their armor set, man. That looks really good. Oh no. Not this again. What, you people didn't have enough fun beating me up at the fort? You gotta come find me here too? You're nothing but thugs in uniform. And your bosses are going to hear about it. Your bosses' bosses. All the way on Coruscant, you hear me? You're going down. Take it easy, man. This was all just a misunderstanding, sir. Calm down. Look, what do you want from me, huh? Because I've had enough of you people for a lifetime. Don't play coy. I think you know what I'm here for. So, now you want the information. Well, you know, I probably could have helped a few hours ago, before that whole savage beating I got. But now, after all the trauma... I might have just forgot everything I ah, knew ah, about any oh, separatist my, bombings. My brain, my brain hurts. I can't remember. I don't have time for games. What do you want? Spit it out. Pushy, pushy, pushy. You grunts just have no respect at all. That's the problem. Now, if I knew how much the Republic valued my contribution, say, with a few credits, my memory would probably be much better. Get a Ranger reward. I'll speak to my superiors about your compensation after we've acted on your intelligence. The same superiors who threw me out of the fort? I don't buy that for a minute. Hmm. Things have changed. The situation is different now. Getting your intel is priority one. Fine, fine, whatever. Just remember who it is who helped you out on this, alright? I saw the Separatists hiding a bunch of he bombs alongside the quit. road near here. You know, setting up an ambush. I heard them say the bombs are time to blow when some troop convoy is going past. I don't know when, but it's got to be soon. So, uh, are we done here? Because I got a lot of work I need to do around the camp today. That's all I needed. Thank you for your cooperation, sir. It's greatly appreciated. Yeah, sure. Uh, anytime. Well, hopefully we actually follow through and pay the guy off, because it would be scummy not to. All right, Sergeant. I copy what Miru said, and this bomb situation sounds like the real thing. I want you to head for the road Miru described and locate the Separatist hidden bombs. A troop convoy is scheduled to move through the area any minute now, so you need to get those bombs defused ASAP. Double time it, soldier. Yes, sir. I'll move out right away. Jorgen out. All right. Take a quick look at my map. Well, we're going this way, so off we go. Let's go, BD. Come on. I don't know where you disappeared to, little droid, but we got a mission. Clock's ticking. Gotta disarm some bombs. Uh oh, I hear blaster fire somewhere. Okay.
feels strange that there's no one else around here. No bad guys. Curiosity. Aha! See, that's what I suspected. It's usually some type of bonus mission, which we're gonna do real quick. I keep beating the B button because I've been playing <laughs> Warcraft so much. B for bags. I have better. Alright, we need to find some more of these guys real quick. too far. I just need four more. I think somebody might have been here just before me and cleared it all out. It's all good. We'll find some more. Thumb wire, thumb hail. Oh, we missed a loot. Go back! What? Hmm. These are passives. Huh. I seem to remember there being like a buff that you get. Apparently, I don't remember correctly. Or that's part of the changes they've made. Alright. ding a ling a ling Now we can head on back. So I'm guessing you just get things as you level now, apparently. You don't have to go back to the trainer, because I don't see anything popping up at my trainer like they used to. It's an interesting new way of doing things. Uh-oh, it's Sergeant. going straight to the Sergeant, excuse me. Sergeant, I'm very sorry to bother you, sir, but... You're the only person I could think to go to. All of the other officers I've met here are completely corrupt. All but you, sir. I know I can trust you. Okay. I appreciate your trust, Private. Now speak freely. What's this all about? It's my CO, Lieutenant Verk. He's scamming everyone in his command, and nobody does anything about it. Verk forces all of us to kick up to him to get safe postings. Credits, weapons, stuff we confiscate from the SEPs, everything. If you don't play along, Verk assigns you to the most dangerous patrol routes on the island. It's like a death sentence. Mmm, that's not good. Corrupt officers give us all a bad name. Someone should report this guy. My buddy tried to report him. The next day, he disappeared to Talaran. And the day after that, he came back in a box. You're in Havoc Squad, sir. You're important. You could talk to someone who matters. Oh, absolutely. Glad to help, man. I'll inform my superiors about Lieutenant Verk's activities immediately, Private. Thank you, sir, so much. I really appreciate this. I do. Not a problem. I just do what I can. I really appreciate it, sir. Thanks again. Ain't no corruptness on my watch. Ah, Sergeant, good to see you again. 
Superb work on that ambush situation. Adaptability like that is what Havoc Squad is all about. So what's really funny to me is because I'm also doing a Cyberpunk 2077 playthrough right now. This guy plays the Ripper Doc that you work with from the beginning, like your buddy the Ripper Doc. And I had no idea it was the same voice actor until just now because I'm doing this playthrough. That's so funny. All right, still no ZR57, unfortunately. We're no closer to finding the bomb than we were before. Not for long. I have good news. Lieutenant Jorgen has finished reviewing the intel from Bellis's field box. It's given us a real breakthrough. Ah, uh, so don't keep me in suspense. What have we learned? Did Bellis manage to uncover the ZR-57's hiding place? He did, Sergeant. Bellis discovered that the Separatists have the ZR-57 secured inside their supply outpost on Manit Point, a small island just off the coast. I sent Wraith ahead to reconnoiter the outpost, and she successfully located a secured area where we believe the bomb is stored. Judging by the dramatic increase in the number of guards and the complex security systems installed, we're certain the bomb is there. Honestly, with security like this, Man at Point looks more like an Imperial military base than a Separatist hideout to me. I think the Seps are getting a helping hand, Commander. From the Imperials? That seems unlikely, Lieutenant. Surely our spies would have discovered any Imperial involvement on Ord Mantell long before now. Mm. The Lieutenant has a point. The Seps do seem unusually well equipped, Commander. We can discuss the possibility of any Imperial connections later. Let's focus on the mission at hand. Wraith can't breach the secure area of the Manit Point outpost alone, so I'm sending you in immediately. The Manit Point bridge is out of commission, so you'll have to make an amphibious approach to the island. When you arrive, effect entry into the supply outpost and rendezvous with Wraith inside. She'll give you further instructions at that time. Understood? I need to report some corruption, sir. Before I go, sir. There's a lieutenant named Burke running a bribery scheme with the men under his command. Burke? I know the guy. He's a pretty pathetic officer. But nobody's ever made any official complaints. None that I heard about, anyway. Lieutenant Jorgen and I will see to this. You should get moving to Manit Point so that you can rendezvous with Wraith inside the Separatist outpost. Dismissed. Well, now we're gonna see if there's any repercussions to me reporting like I just did. Um, we'll be finding out soon. In the meantime, that is the wrap-up point for this episode, everybody. So don't forget to like, subscribe, hit the bell icon so you get more in this series and beyond. Don't forget to support the channel in any way you can because it keeps me going full-time here on YouTube. Join the Discord, all those good things, and we'll see you in the next episode.